Man, there's never a spot in here. I have class in 15 minutes, and if I can't find a spot, I may or may not go. Especially about to park on the street. What's up, man? What's up, dude? How you doing? Good, man. Good. Oh, you finally found a parking space? Finally, after 10 minutes. I was oh, late for that. Class. Dang. Is it electric car parking only? Like, probably got a ticket. Oh, man. Luckily, it be, luckily I didn't. Wouldn't it be great if they had another parking garage? That would be more than great, man. They definitely needed to. Oh, yeah. the students are getting. Definitely. This university is growing every year. Doubt, They're going to need to build one eventually. Exactly. Top. How will we go on solving this problem using technology? Well, I think we can continue to use cameras for security in the garage, in the new garage we're going to build. And also, we could uh, use the cameras to check to see how full the parking lots are. Possibly you know, before you leave out for class in the morning. And I also think we could continue to use our gall cards for entering and exiting the garage. Alright, and what about operational? Well, I think SU will support this project because parking is needed, especially with the new Purdue School that's uh, going to be opening soon. It's going to bring in even more students than we have now. Alright, and that brings us to political. Well, the obvious issue here is that we'd have to convince the Dean and management of uh, Salisbury University of the, the benefits of this project. Uh, we would also probably have to convince uh, state and county um, uh, lawmakers in order to get permits uh, to build a parking garage. Uh, and that sort of ties into legal because uh, we would have to get we have to uh, get the permits and we would also have to find contractors um, which we could hire at a reasonable rate. All right, and what about economics? Well, I think this project is economically feasible. This garage will cost a lot up front, but I believe eventually it will pay off. In the long run, I could see SU being able to create extra revenue from this garage by selling extra permits and even, you know, tickets to visitors or Something. All right, and what about environmental? If we build the garage on an already built parking lot, we'll get a lot more parking spaces, and this way the green policy is still upheld and we won't lose any grass areas. All right, and what about the schedule? If everything goes as planned, we expect the garage to be built by spring semester of 2012.